All right, ladies and gentlemen, so today your depression will come back, but there is some good news about Battlefield 6 livestream that will cure your depression. We also got some good Call of Duty news. Got six things that I want to talk about, so let's go for six likes on the video. Check this out, bro. Keemstar uploaded this video, and I swear to God, if you do any of this and you're not an oil prince, I swear you deserve to be slapped. Like, check this out. This mother got 43, 49 down. I'm gonna f you up. 49. Get the f out. Get up. I'm gonna beat your f Beat it, mama. You better go to, to sleep. Go to sleep. Man, if I did that, I wouldn't be going to sleep. If I did that, like, my mama wouldn't be putting me to sleep. She would be putting me to purr my sleep, mother... Like, this is... Dude, who are these people? Back when, you know, like, I, I, like, I, I remember the times, like, 2008, 2010, 2012s. Uh, you know, 2012s, yes. 2012s and 2013s. Black Ops 2 came up. They were dropping, like, Camels DLCs, like, $2 a pop, $3 a pop. I was sitting in Canada. I'm still sitting in Canada. So, you know, let's up it, like, by $1. Let's say $4.99. You would get, like, a Camel. You would get a Reticle. You would get the whole pack. Now, these kids out there... 49,000 V Bucks, bro. Some, uh, bro, bro, I just, you're emptying out your parents' bank accounts. The homie Ethan added me in the situation. According to his maths out here, it's about $616, but I definitely need more mathematicians out there. This is next level, bro. I, I just cannot believe it. But you wanna know what? Also in the news, you know, also in the news, Charlie Intel came out. And this is just comedy, bro. This is just comedy. Just the other day, we had a 7 gigabyte file update, and I was like, bro, we're in before. We're in before another disaster. We're gonna have probably another secondary update. 25 gigs. I believe I said something like that. I thought I was exaggerating with 25 gigs, but you know what? Uh, Activision and Call of Duty was like, yo, hold my beer, son. Hold my beer. PlayStation 5 and PlayStation 4. 52 gigs! Xbox and Xbox Series X and S. 57.8 gigs and bro we're talking about the xbox one the, the vcr why is it like more than the playstation 4 it should be almost the same or a little bit less we're talking about the the xbox one right and xbox series x okay better graphics isn't that 12 teraflops bro the point here is that these motherfuckers are crazy these mother gotta be locked up they they are wild and out like pc 52.4 gigs for the warzone and 133.6 gigs for warzone plus modern warfare I, I just can't. This update will be dropping on uh, March 30th at 11 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. We're definitely going to be rolling. We're going to be live streaming. And there is more to this update that I will be talking about in this video. But you can see the, the, the streets are straight up comedy. We got Dr. Inibal here. The homie new added me in the situation. Uh, people have terrible Wi-Fi. Okay, this man's spitting facts. People have terrible Wi-Fi are going to suffer because of this. Smash a like. I'm a smash a like button. These are nothing but facts. Could you imagine somebody that actually has a one megabyte per download speed? This is the example that I always like to bring in, you know, here and there. But it is true, bro. This is true. These are facts. There are motherfuckers out there that are living on one megabyte per download speed. And, bro, I'm just putting my hands together. That's all I'm doing. I, I, I cannot do anything more than that. I'm just a guy like you. I'm just putting my hands together. It's just time to stop, Activision. Like, seriously, Activision, this is the baseline. And you're right above here. It's time to chill, okay? This is just beyond, bro. Like, I, I just cannot understand it. Also, in the news, now it is official. Just the other day, we were talking rumors and leaks uh, about the fact that Sony will be shutting down the PlayStation Store for the Sony Pony PS3. And you know what? Rare picture of my fat PS3. Smash a like button. I mean, I've been showing here and there, so now it's not that rare. But it is still ultra rare. Sony has put up a full-blown article. They say that you will still be able to re-download and play previously purchased game titles so in my opinion that's actually good because we were debating that are we gonna be able to re-download the games that we purchased or is it just gonna be a full-blown shutdown looks like that it is a shutdown but it's like a slow burn right they're gonna start off with this shutdown maybe later on like maybe like in a year or two years time they're gonna shut down the online and five ten years from now they're gonna shut down the whole thing but starting july you will not be able to purchase on ps3 ps vita and psp and you will also no longer gonna be able to make in-game purchases that's a small w because in-game purchases do, do you see this do you see this like 49,000 v bucks these are the in-game purchases so in a way i'm actually glad that homies will not be able to spend money on microtransactions to be honest we should just ban the whole situation we should ban the in-game purchases <laughs> completely i mean some in-game purchases
purchases are fine, you know, if, if it's a story mode DLC. Stuff like that is a pogger, but man, purchasing 49,000 V-Bucks. If I did that, my mama wouldn't let me do YouTube, okay? Like, facts no printer, okay? Facts no printer, facts no printer. Johnny says that who would play this crap anyway? Hashtag proud PlayStation 5 owner. And meanwhile, the homie got caught with that 4K camera. <laughs> <Ow. laughs> Bro, stuff like that is just wild. There are surely some people out there that uh, that doesn't even have PS4 that that are still stuck with PS3. Do they want to be stuck with that? Eh, some of them, yes, but most of them would definitely love to get PS5. And bro, we're in the wrong situation. Yes, I have the RTX 3090. I have the PS5 as well. But I totally do understand that some people are not able to find them even if they have the moolah. Some of them don't have the moolah to spend on stuff like that. They got priorities, mother Sad day in the history of gaming, ladies and gentlemen. Like, who would have thought that we're gonna be sitting here talking about the PS3, the, the glory days getting shut down, right? Also, in the news, patch 1.2 for Cyberpunk 2077 is now live on the PC and consoles, a version for Stadia. I mean, who cares about Stadia? Get one, okay? Drop it for PS4, PS5, Xbox, Series X, Series S, PC Master Race. Bro, this is a small W, right? Like, I know that sometimes I like to joke around, I meme on the situation. You also like to clown on it. You like to meme on it and whatnot. I mean, you know, we're just joking around. But I heard numbers like CD Projekt Red is coming out with 400 fixes. To camp number one, this is gonna sound like a good news that, hey, at least they are actually doing it. And I'm semi part of that group. I'm like, okay, they are trying to fix the game. And you know what? They got my full support. Obviously, Cyberpunk is a snoozer right now, but you're looking to fix the game and go all out for it but camp number two will be like yo that's the point i'm trying to make you know they, they're coming out with 400 fixes and they still got a million more to go so uh give them all okay and as kimberly sweet brown once said bro like i ain't got time to read this i respect it i'm glad that they're fixing the game also in the news the roadmap for black ops and warzone season 2 reloaded was put out by treyarch the big thing here is that we're gonna be getting the sanatorium night map so finally a night zombies map in this game i was thirsting out in fact i was pretty hungry for a night map in this game yes it's an outbreak map it's not like a quote-unquote dlc we're also getting a couple of multiplayer maps we're getting a new weapon we're getting new operators a new dirt bike season 2 reloaded do be looking good but is it looking 52 gigabytes good i'm not sure about that one okay you be the judge also in the news we're having more leaks and rumors regarding ea play and battlefield 6 live stream or i should say battlefield only because earlier today i did make a dedicated video because tom henderson came out he leaked campaign stuff he leaked the setting it's near futuristic he was talking about the trailer like what we're gonna see it when we're gonna see it and all of that and this leak specifically out here is talking about ea play and says that this ea play is gonna be happening on june 14 at 11 a.m eastern very specific i mean it's just a rumor so don't let your dogs out but i, I feel like that either this is a credible leak or just an educated guess even me i see this happening too my guy because we're gonna be having e3 this year and ea play usually happens around around that time you know june 9 10 11 11, 12, 13. So these are basically the dates, but he says June 14. That's when we're going to be having the stream. And during the stream, we're going to be having Sims 5, Apex Legends. But the main thing is uh, Battlefield 6, right? We're going to have the gameplay trailer, the dev interview, and the release date is November 19, 2021. Sounds very plausible. It also claims that we're going to be having Frostbite 4th Gen engine trailer. Let's see what happens. We're officially in the end game. According to Tom, we're going to be having the CGI cutscene in May. And I guess it, it is what it is. And even I expected, I fully believe that we're gonna see something at EA Play in June and that's most likely gonna be a multiplayer trailer, like a real gameplay trailer. Well, ladies and gentlemen, push your kids to beds, hide your wives because Epic is sending out surveys asking what Fortnite crossovers you want to see, such as Persona, Resident Evil, GTA. The homie, Ali, added me in this situation, says, I want you want, I want Spider-Man. Seriously, man, I swear to God, if they, if they put Spider-Man in this game, uh, I wouldn't mind. I really wouldn't mind because now it's over, dude. They they put out Lara Croft in the game and that's the only thing that I did not want and uh but check out this video on the screen hit the subscribe bell so i can interrupt you every time you're about to score on your crush subscribe subscribe subscribe